It's stinking here. Oh my God. It's stinking here. What is that? Oh, hey, it's Brie. I really don't know where this smell is coming from in my car. I know I've been eating lunch in my car and I know I spilled chicken salad in here the other day, but I can't see, like I don't see. Let me move my seat. Yeah, like, there's no food where I think food would be. I think I just need to go get my car washed. I'm hanging on to, like, my last four lashes. Since I cannot go get my lashes done until next week. Which means by next week, I will have no lashes at all. <sighs> <laughs> Being a bad bitch is so hard. Like, it's so hard. So, because I cannot get my lashes done, I'm gonna go get my nails fixed. I'm so ashy. One of these days, I'm gonna go to the mall, I'm gonna go in Bath and Body Works, and I'm gonna get some cute little lotions. It's 10.49 in the morning. I like to get stuff done early. Oh my God, it's literally drizzling right now. Fuck. I guess we're not going to the car wash. Like, literally, it started fucking drizzling. Let me just roll the window down. Where is that smell coming from? I want somebody else to clean my car. I don't want to clean it. It needs to be cleaned. Fuck, why did it start raining? Why did it start drizzling? Why? Damn. Okay, I guess we're gonna go tomorrow. We're gonna do that tomorrow. But today we're gonna get my nails fixed. I have no idea how I want to do my nails. We're gonna listen to some music too. Actually, let me set that up. Let me see what I want to hear. I want to hear something like chill. So I'm gonna put this play this. Do I really want to hear this? I don't. I don't want to hear it. I want to roll the window down and get the fucking smell out of my car. But for the sake of the quality of the video, I know that the wind, the cars, the freeway, all of that is going to get on my nerve when I'm editing this video. So I will continue to suffer for my craft. This is my shit. I will never skip this song. This is my shit right here. Shut up, period, eh. period, oh. Is that cultural appropriation if I do that? <laughs> All right, let's go in here and get our fucking nails done. I'm only getting my nails because it's a state of fucking emergency. It's kind of like cold and rainy. I don't even want to be outside all day, but it might be busy, bitch. So let me go in there and at least put my name in because I was going to sit here and talk to you guys and I was like, and then you'll be 25th in line and you'll be sitting here for an hour. So yeah, let me go in there and tell them what I need and figure out how I want my nails to look. So yes. See you soon. Hey guys, I'm back. And I feel like my energy is different now because my nails are done. Let me show you. This is my first time getting glow in the dark nails. I know you guys have seen me with like a similar color, but this is literally my first time getting glow in the dark. I love them. Like I told you guys at the beginning of the video, I'm not really vibing with how my car smells today, but I do need to figure out what I'm gonna eat. So I would like you guys to join me as I make that decision. I do want to make dinner for myself. I need to go to the grocery store in general because when I was getting my nails in today, I was thinking about like sacrifices that I need to make and I'm considering like not smoking weed anymore, like eliminating that expense because I really want to move. This is going to be a journey like obviously for both of us because I'm bringing you guys with me. I'm just really trying to figure out like how to be smarter with my money, what I could sacrifice because I'm not going to sacrifice the lashes. I'm not going to sacrifice my nails. You know what I'm saying? So I got to give up something and I think I could give up weed I mean I've done it before like I've gone months without smoking before so I don't know why they came over my spirit to tell you guys but that's the vibe that I'm on I'm going to look on my phone and see what I could eat if you guys knew how my car usually smell it usually smells so fucking good I'm gonna do it tomorrow I'm gonna go get my car washed tomorrow like it's okay it's okay I could wait another day I don't even know what I'm in the mood for do I want to get hibachi do i want fried fish but it's sunday so i don't even know if i'll really be able to get fried fish what the fuck i'm gonna eat though 
Okay, so hibachi, Mexican food, obviously. I'm almost burnt out on El Pollo Loco. I've been eating it so much. I consider going to in and out There's a burger spot that I like called Master Burger. There's Wingstop. I could order a pizza. I had Popeyes yesterday. What do I want to eat? It's like I want to eat something new, but I'm starting to get hungry to the point that like if it's not fire i'm gonna be mad like i'm getting hungry to the point i don't want to try something new but i do want to try something new so it's like let me go on yelp let me go on yelp for dinner i do want to make myself like you know like a traditional american dinner like i want to have like steak maybe some sauteed spinach maybe a little surf and turf maybe i'll do steak and shrimp because i got some shrimp in the freezer but i do feel like cooking that's why i want this meal to just be very satisfying what does satisfying give does that give like comfort food does that give like a taco bell chick-fil-a kind of vibe i just had chipotle mcdonald's is out of the question my thing is i want to eat as close to real food as possible which is probably why i spend so much money on food <laughs> There's this one place I'm thinking about going, but I really don't want to drive. I'm about to settle for El Pollo Loco, if you really want me to be honest. Because I'm hungry, and it's so cheap. Let me see how many Pollo points I have. Yes, I have points. Oh my god, I have $5. We're going to El Pollo Loco. I won't even have to spend money. What should we listen to? I want to listen to something that's going to have me feeling good about myself. Like, get ready to turn up with the big boys. That's my choice. A few moments later. It's a fucking bike marathon going on. If you knew how deep I am in South Central right now, you will understand why I'm shocked that on a day like this, bitches are riding bikes. Like, really? It's a bike marathon. It's a bike marathon. I'm, oh my God, I'm playing my music. I can't with this. I'll be stunning with my click. Get it faded till we trip. It's actually really starting to rain now at this point. Um at the stop sign, turn right. I'm gonna pull I'm gonna pull over. Shut up, bitch. Damn. I am pulling over. I am closer to my house. But I'm going to pull over, I'm going to turn the car off, and we're going to figure out what we're going to- Oh, I said I was going to go to El Pollo Loco, right? Okay, well, yeah, I don't like the one by my house, so I'm going to figure out which one to go to. I need to keep track of which El Pollo Locos by my house I actually like, because for me to eat El Pollo Loco so much, I should know which one is the best one over here, like, for real. Starting route to El Pollo Loco. I'm, like, fucking going 60 miles an hour. I'm so hungry. I was telling my nail tech, but I really don't think she understood what I was saying. Pretty sure there was a language barrier there. I was like, girl, tell me why as soon as you did my nails, I got a new job and I broke them literally the next day. Like my black nails that I had, I didn't even get to enjoy them like that. Because literally my first day I was going up the stairs and I fell going up the stairs and I went obviously to protect myself from the impact and rip my middle nail in half and so because of that i did want to get my nails shorter but the bad bitch in me really wouldn't allow it i feel like this length is cool for what i do for work oh my god it just started raining like but yeah super happy that i knocked this out of the way because working in beverly hills your appearance really does matter and i don't want to be the girl with like a broken nail especially because like my job sells Birkin bags and stuff like that so imagine somebody's like oh can I see this Birkin bag and then I'm missing a nail I told you guys at the beginning of the video I'm holding on to like eight lashes literally four lashes on each eye bitch hi there what can we get started with you? um hey can I have um the classic tostada salad I don't want sour cream though yeah can I have extra pico though that'd be cool it's a combo right Make it a combo? Okay. Yeah. I always feel like I only have energy to do like one thing a day. I work nine hours, five days a week. Sometimes when I get off work, I want to go and I want to do a little bit of shopping. Like I need to get um, a different pair of work shoes. 
Um, there's stuff that I want to do when I get off work and I just never have the energy. And I notice that I'm like that. Like I can only do one thing a day. And I used to think that it was because I didn't have a car and I just didn't want to like Uber everywhere. Getting in and out of Ubers was just a lot of energy for me, but I don't think that's the case. I don't think that's the case. I think I just don't like to be bothered. I think I like to be in the house. When I didn't have a car, I used to fantasize about road trips. Bitch, I get irritated driving like 40 minutes. So being in a car for like six hours, yikes. I'm a clown and I do it for the likes. Cause best believe there's road trip content on the way. I talk about it every day. I cannot wait to go on a road trip. Hi. Um, I got these Poyo points that I want to use. Love your bucket hat too, by the way. Thank you, thank you. You have great energy. Oh, thank you. you yeah. Should... Thank you, appreciate it, appreciate it, appreciate it. I feel sane. Yeah, I know, right? That's creepy. That's how you know. Vibes are... Hell yeah. Right there. And then the extra sauce is on the side. Thank you. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. You as well. Thank you. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Okay, we was having a nice off. We was having a nice off, like who's nicer than who? Thank God nobody's behind me because I need to put my card away. And yeah, we made it to the end of this vlog, you guys. Another successful vlogging day. I just wanna rough neck nigga on the top. He just wanna send me automatic with a truck. Give me that so extend up. Okay, I don't know what's going on. I don't know why literally everybody's driving slow. But I do want to say thank you guys for coming with me to the nail salon. I know I didn't vlog inside the nail salon, but I never do that. I honestly will probably never vlog while I'm getting my nails done. That's my me time. I've said that before, and I think I'm just reiterating that to myself. Either way it goes, I'm pretty sure you guys are loving the content. So go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Support your girl. Get those fingers moving in the comments below. And yeah. I knew what I was going to say, but it just slipped my mind. I need to fucking eat. Let me know what else you guys want to see. Okay, guys. Um, Till next time. Love you. Ah! Ah! <laughs> no, but I did almost hit this bitch. Okay, bye, y'all.